Hello guys and welcome in this new course. In this course we're going to learn how to use a small Arduino card in order to control small scale size industrial automation projects. So let's say you have a small machine or a very small factory and you want to control it. How can you do that without like spending a lot of money on heavy equipments like like heavy PLC equipments. Now PLC is not really substitutable I can admit that but if you have something small scale, you can actually substitute a PLC with a small Arduino card. That's doable. We're going to do that through soft PLC installed on a computer or using an HMI, which is, let's say, mounted on your electrical automation panel. Now, I know I have said a lot of terms right now, but we're going to dig into each one of them and explain them in details. So let's get started. This is our first topology. We'll be having two topologies. The goal is to control this machine here, or small factory. And in order to do that, we need to go through all of these steps. Now, it may look complicated, but it's really not. We'll be having here a soft PLC. A soft PLC is actually a software PLC. So you don't have the actual PLC device, but you have a software installed on a, some OS like Windows or a Mac or a Linux or whatever and it has all the program for that PLC. However, you know, soft PLC, well, since it's on a computer, you won't be having any input-output spins. So you cannot really directly control contactors, relays, and whatsoever. So we need a buffer in order to take all of these signals and actuate the real hardware. How can we do that? We're going to establish a communication between soft PLC and the Ethernet shield of the Arduino. An Ethernet shield will be communicating with this software PLC using TCP IP and what's called a Modbus protocol encapsulated inside that TCP IP. So, we'll learn how to do all of that. Now, this shield will be uh, mounted on the Arduino as we know, and then our shield is going to activate a set of relays in order to control this stuff inside this uh, automation panel. Now, why would we need that? Now, here we will have a set of relays, contactors, VFDs, which also will explain in detail what does each of them mean. And you need to control them, but the voltage rate here is actually 24 volts, so the Arduino cannot really activate the industrial relays and industrial contactors. So we need an intermediate. So here, these relays work with five volts, so we can activate each of them using Arduino with five volts. Then from the contacts of the relay, we can conduct 24 volts in order to, co to control the real industrial equipment inside this automation panel. Then this automation panel will be activating this uh, factory here. So the program and the heavy programming will be written in this soft PLC and the Arduino used as a I.O. buffer and a communication tool in order to communicate with this soft PLC. So this is our first topology. So what's required here? A computer, Ethernet shield, Arduino, Uno, let's say, or whatever uh, board you're using, we're going to stick to Uno here. So please stick with us to Uno then, because I'm not sure how this will work with other boards. Uh, it could work, but there would be maybe a small, small tweaking in order to get it to work, because I didn't test it with other boards. And we need a set of relays here. You can use uh, small relays, you don't have to buy this six channel. But I'm just buying this because I have many stuff that I want to actuate. And this automation control panel, well, I'm sure you don't need to buy this one. We can use simulation here in order to see how will this stuff work. But I'll also make some demonstration videos to show you guys how we can actuate with uh, this automation panel. And here is our factory, which we will not see in this course, but we will see how the signals are being actuated and how the feedback is coming back. So, yeah. Now let's go to the second topology, which is driving with HMI. An HMI is a screen that's used everywhere in industrial automation. And usually this screen is connected to a PLC and this PLC is controlled using this HMI. 
So here, let's say you have your factory or machine. You just click on uh, buttons in order to activate uh, the different uh, parts, or you can just click start and stuff will go and work automatically. Usually the program is in a PLC, but what we're going to do here is we're going to throw away PLC and we're going to use the Arduino equipment in order to control. So here, the heavy programming will be inside the Arduino and not like the soft uh, PLC where the heavy programming is inside the software of the soft PLC. The other stuff is the same. This is the only different part. So, hope you're ready guys for this course. And I'm sure you're going to learn a lot of stuff about industrial automation and about using Arduino on something really like useful or something like a real world application. So, can't wait to start with you guys. See you in the next lecture.